EA Games. Challenge everything. Yeah, shit just got real. Welcome to, welcome back to Let's Play Harry Potter and the Chamber Potter Se Ch Chamber Seeds. Yeah. Now, you want me noticing that you're not hearing Zach's voice right now? Well, because before I tried it, this with Zach, and it, eh, he doesn't know enough about this game. Plus, you guys just want it to be me, right? The person who started playing this excuse me game. Thank you. The person who started Let's Playing this game, and I'm going to do it again, because, well, I did a horrible job last time. <sighs> you can see for yourself, it's one of my first Let's Plays. So anyways, let's get this shit started. If Harry Potter I suppose I could be back to Hogwarts, this. he will be in mortal danger. Rob, look! <laughs> That was the opening. And now, now, my beautiful friends, this is when I tried it before, but, you know. Yeah. Plus, when I'm doing it by myself, I can find better times to record. Like now, at 7.36 in the morning. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait. Now, can I just... Fine, I'll just do Potter B. Because apparently there's, like, a second universe of Potter... Yes, a second universe of Potter. How amazing is that? <sighs> this is why you don't let twelve-year-old twelve-year-old drive. Welcome to the borough, Harry. Especially when the car is flying. If I sound tired or not funny today, it's because I just woke up. Seven. Did seven any of you ever morning. give a thought of how Saturday, worried I'd be? November my bed's empty, no note, car gone. You know what, bitch? Um, I have crashed um, out I... of my mind with worry. Did you care? Never. As long as I've but lived. Mom. Now get outside and start denoming. I've had it up to here with all of you. Relative to what? Except you, of course, Relative Harry. from me to you? I'm not cross with you. Relative from the Earth to the Sun? Relative to what? <laughs> Anyways. You ready to do a bit of denying then, Harry? Why are you standing behind well, me like sure. that? I've been with Dursley so much this summer. I'm a little rusty. And as usual, I'm going to switch to that. Well, as usual, jeez. That got the machine from Gamble and You know James, what, bitch? So we could test the power of our spells. <sighs> Don't worry about getting the shield to the top, Potter. Once you learn some second year magic, you'll be able to ring the bell. Why the hell do you have a traffic cone? It's clearly no one in your family can drive. Depend of the glass jar. You know, I'll do whatever I want, homo. Old bots, millions are found in all kinds of places, bitch. They can be used to trade with Fred and George when you reach Hogwarts. I just wonder why it's called Hogwarts. Was there a hog that had warts? And that's where they get it, got the name from? A wart on a hog. That was truly smashing, Harry. Oh. Oh. When you're ready, we'll meet you in I the I see bar. what he did there. <laughs> that was fucking funny. You gotta come to the corner. Yeah, I, I've been through this before. 
whenever I see that member ball, I never know. I never remember what I'm supposed to be remembering. There are gnomes everywhere. Yeah, Ugh. I'm looking Look, at one right now. They're up in the rafters. Okay, yeah, I'm not Harry, talking about the one on the rafter. Bing. Hand over them off the rafter. And it, it's always a good idea to kind of miss them because you get um beans for it, like from these sacks. See, dude, I'm not gonna get my bean. God damn it! They're heading for the garden. We'll meet you out in the barnyard. You better, my bean better still be there. Oh, you motherfucker! You did not just do that, honey. Uh uh. Now, why is there a rubber ducky in here? Oh, I didn't. Last time I didn't notice this chest. I think I know who, which wizard this is. Number one, Merlin. Most famous wizard of all time, sometimes known as the Prince of Enchanters, part of the court of King Arthur. Yeah. Well, he kind of is, considering the fact that I even know who that is. Hmm. Perhaps I should go into the barnyard. Hey, hey, hey. Shut up. Open that shit up. Number three, Elfrida Clagg. Chieftainess of Warlock's Council. That's amazing. Also, for my last let's play, you can kind of notice the different the difference Harry, in my voice like and jokes. We'd like you to be doll washing machine. Huh? Is they are both better this time around. Now it's anything but charming. This is a good opportunity to practice some dueling. Dueling? And watch out when the washing machine yeah, opens dueling. its door. And a two-syllable word. Pendo when the door is open. I fucked up at this last time because I have had no practice. Open the fuck up! Don't be scared, Harry. It won't bite much. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. I think you can like shoot it and then dodge. Like, yeah, there you go. Epic dodge. It's like that washing machine in our bed that you turn into a banjo kazooie that has like the same attack. Of course, I never played banjo kazooie, but you know, I've seen NCS. It's okay. I know. I know. Bitch, you just got told. Sorted it, Harry. I'd love to see that in Art Petunia's kitchen. Ha! You look like you need a chocolate frog. Here you go. You have to knock the frog out before you can catch Those things really it. taste right. like chocolate, Let's go or... Throw some nose. Well, dude, it's we'll like you you running all over the ground. Ready, Why would I want to eat that, you sick fuck? I can look through a taco frog. Those aren't inventory things or anything. They actually just heal you right then and there. Nah. When did Zach's mom get here? When did Zach's... Damn it. I fucked up the joke. Because I heard the sheep, like, you know... Making we its need noise. to get a move on with the Dino. Hey, hey, Mom is going hey, mad if shut up. any gnomes left in the garden. Look, there's one over there. What you have to do is flip Pendo them until they're dazed and confused. Then you grab hold of them and spin them Look at this! <laughs> and chuck them out of the garden. <laughs> wow, I've got to try this. I know. Right? Be my guest. And remember, flipendo the gnome, pick it up, spin it round, and chuck it over the low wall. <laughs> I bet you can't throw a gnome as far as Fred did. Or hit any of the targets in the fields over there. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I bet you won't win in a stabbing contest. Anyways. Sorry about that cut. Number eight. Derwent Shrimpling. If you throw it farther than them, you get... Number eight, Derwent Swirpling. By the way, I'm not going to get all of these because, for, for one thing, they're annoying to find. Plus, plus, I think some of them you actually have to trade for. Brilliant, bro, Harry. Brilliant, bro, Harry. But it, when you get eight, it does, like, max up your life. Thing. Ow. My beans. Now I won't be able to poop more. <laughs> Gee, dude, how the hell? Is my magic not powerful enough to go through leaves? 
Man, Harry, you really do suck. <laughs> that was a good throw, sort of. Jeez, yes. Harry. Now, if I threw it straight, that would have gone really far. Did you have to, like, it's... I think it's, like, one, two, three, four, five, six rotations you get. That was probably about as good as you could do. Throw, Harry. You could do better than four, 410 plus a video response or something. I guess. It's like anyone's ever gonna actually do that. That was a wicked throw! Hey. Hey. Love to see you do better. <laughs> I wish I could do this to Ron. That, that would be the day. The day when gingers reign. I'm sorry. <laughs> when gingers reign. Oh, that's funny. I would be making a lot more ginger jokes if Zach was here, I bet. That was a wicked throw. Dude, I'm out of drink. Time for bed, Ayo. then day tomorrow, Diagon Alley, then Platform 9 and 3 quarters. For someone who's never denomed before, you've done an excellent job, Harry. Really to be proud Almost of. as good as Gilderoy Lockhart himself. Thanks, Mrs. Weasley. I think you deserve a chocolate frog. I think you deserve a chocolate frog. Chocolate, chocolate, it's a chocolate frog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't forget, pick them up and spin them round. And chuck them out of the garden. Don't forget, pick them up and spin them Damn around it. and chuck them out of the garden. Yeah, you can keep doing it until you get, like, something good, but you don't really get anything else. I think you might if you hit the scarecrow, but I'm not totally sure. Oh, yeah. Whoa. His hair keeps, like, his hair was keeping, yeah, his hair keeps moving whenever you, like, pause. That's pretty cool. Damn it, yeah. Please, we woke them all early the following Wednesday. She took a flower pot off the kitchen mantelpiece, and everyone grabbed a handful of flu powder. Harry had never traveled by flu powder before, and when he scattered the powder into the fireplace, he immediately swallowed a lot of hot ash. He swallowed something hot. Zing. Diagon <coughs> Alley! It felt as though he was being sucked down a chimney's plug. <laughs> That's what Harry she tried said. to keep his eyes open, but the whirling <laughs> made him sick. He closed his eyes, wishing it That's would stop. That's also what she said. He fell. And that's, um, well, if it's a really big guy, I guess. That that last line could be, that's what she said. Okay. I don't know, what the fuck is that thing? That thing looks like one of those enemies in Rayman too. I think. Don't judge. Shut up. If you hear barely any noise in the background, that's a fan. This place is creepy, I must say. Oh, dude, get the fuck away from that hand. You see what I mean? Like, holy shit. Yes, I know. Let's check out this thing before we leave. I never noticed those barrels. Can you actually come back and hit those barrels? I'm gonna check that out. Because I just saw barrels in the background. Draco oh no, who needs a fucking Touch book that big? Nothing, What's normal with like, you know, a regular uh, size book? Mr. Ford, Mr. Malfoy, what a pleasure to Mr. see Malfoy. you. Mr. Malfoy, what a pleasure to see you again. Magic is conducting more raids, and I have a few more uh, items like this at home that might embarrass you. Yeah. Items, items that you are willing to sell. Items of the Correct. triple X variety. I expect you tomorrow at the yes. manor to pick them up. Good day. Good day, Mr. Boy. That gives you the, uh, Lumo spell, which is like kind of like a flashlight, which I don't know why he's, like, scared of having that, but, you know, whatever. Oh no, she. Oh no, you didn't. Yeah, see, they're barrels. Can I. Uh, I guess they're not the barrels that you can destroy, never mind then. So I'm gonna go save and then we'll end this video. And since this will probably be a very popular video, 
make sure to check out my other shit and subscribe and comment or whatever. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Uh -huh.